Hi everyone! My name is Essie and today I would like to talk about a product called Atomi Hong Sam Dan. Hong means red, Sam means ginseng, and Tan means spherical granules. So actually it is Atomi Red Ginseng Granules. Get it? But I still get a lot of questions about this product and often I give them a story that goes like this. Once upon a time, more than a thousand years ago, farmers in Korea found this ginseng root had a lot of health benefits. It's good for energy boost and it enhances memory and alleviates fatigue. Wow, it became lucrative so quickly and they started to export to China. The only problem was though, this white ginseng was only good in room temperature for three to four days maximum. They had to find a way to store this ginseng better. So this is, we're talking about like a thousand years back. So they found a way, naturally process it, brew it, dry it. So white ginseng became red ginseng. Now the problem has been solved and they're able to export it out. And to this day, it's more than a $2 billion industry. And one of the biggest health product market in Korea. So now, why Adami Hong Sam Dan? I'll give you three points. Number one, Tomi Hong Sam Dan has nothing but red ginseng. 100% red ginseng in it. There's no water, there's no sweetener, there's no apple juice, there's nothing. No water whatsoever, and I know that's very hard to do. And we have two patents attached to this product, and the very first patent has to do with it. Just think about a very big glass room and somebody shooting in the extract liquid form of red ginseng and there's strong wind taking away all the moisture away from this liquid. What's left? The condensed powder of red ginseng extract and that is what they make this Hong Sam Dan with. Number two, I told me Hong Sam Dan has 20 milligram per gram of ginsenocytes. Is that a lot? Absolutely. In Korea, if a product has 0.8 milligram per gram of ginsenocytes, then they say, okay, you can market this as red ginseng product, no problem. Usually, the higher brands is 3 to 5.5. That's a standard uh, for ginsenocytes to be contained. And usually they're fine with it. But a Tomi red ginseng granules has 20 milligram per gram of ginsenocytes. Ginsenocytes is also known as saponins and that is the very reason why we take it and they usually note on each box the amount of RG1, RB1, RG3 and they have to note it on the box and 20 milligram is almost four times of the next leading brand which is the most popular. It's been popular forever and we're talking about value here, high potency, Hong Sam Dan, 20 milligram per gram. Number three, remember the second patent? What would that be? Can you hear it? Yes, this patent has to do with having this Hong Sam Dan into spherical granules so that you can take it with you anywhere. You can just put it in your pocket to go outside or you can just um, put it in your bag, in your car, so easy to take around and this melts pretty well in water. It just doesn't have to be um, uh, too cold. As long as it's not ice cold, this will melt very well and it melts well in milk and I know some people go far and they put it in their coffee. I never tried that but I have to tell you my favorite recipe for Hong Sam Dan tea is, ta-da! Yes, it's getting cold in Toronto. It actually snowed yesterday, and when it gets cold, and this is what I do, we can get up in the morning, boil some water, and two hemohem and Hong Sam Dan in a mug. And I drink it like tea, coffee, and you know what? I am ready for whatever is gonna bring me that day after this cup of two hemohem and Hong Sam Dan tea. So what's your favorite recipe you can share? Other than that, this is it from me and 
Happy Hong Sam Dan, everybody.